children, my name's Emma. Let's start our Letters and Sounds lesson and learn to read some new words. Let's read some phonemes you already know. I'll show you the graphemes on the cards and I want you to read them aloud. Do you remember this digraph? Two letters, one sound. It makes the sound ooh. There are also two ways of saying this grapheme. It says ow in words like cow and o oh in words like grow. Now it's your turn. Off you go and remember some of them have two sounds. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. Ooh. Ow or o. Oh. I. Oo or you. Oo or you. E. O. S. Now I'm going to mix the cards up. Can you read the graphemes on the cards aloud? I think you can. Off you go. Let's check you got them right. Read aloud with me. Ooh or you. E, S, I, U or U, O, U, Ow or O. Well done! Super sounds! Now let's read some words with graphemes we already know. Can you spot a digraph in this word? Remember, two letters, one sound. Yes! This digraph says O. Oh. Read each sound as I point, then blend and read the word. G, R, O, grow. Every year you grow a bit taller. Now, can you see the digraph in this word? Yes, the digraph is O. Oh. Read each sound, then blend. I, why? When we ask a question, we often start with why. How about the digraphs in this word? Yes, the digraphs are mm. and e. Read each sound, then blend. Mm. E, all, wheel. My bike has a wobbly wheel, unfortunately. Hopefully it will be fixed soon. Can you see the digraphs in this word? Yes, the digraphs are here and here. Read each sound, then blend. E -g -o, eagle. What an amazing bird the eagle is. They really are stunning, aren't they? Now, can you spot the digraph in this word? Yes, the digraph is or. Read each sound, then blend. P or poor. My dog got mud on his paws. This dog seems to have got mud on his paws too. Now I bet you can see the digraph in this word. Yes, the digraph is U. Read each sound, then blend. S, M, E, E, 
smelly. The cheese was old and rather smelly. Whew. Well done, everyone. I'm going to mix the cards up. Do you think you can read the words on the cards, but without sounding out? I bet you can. You ready? Off you go. Let's check. Read them with me. Eagle. Paw. Why. Smelly. Grow. Wheel. Brilliant work. Today we are learning a new grapheme for the phoneme s. s, s. Copy me. Now let's sound talk some words with the phoneme s. Copy me. Say the sounds, then blend the sounds to say the word. M, mm, I, s. M, mm, I, s. Your turn. M, mm, I, s. Mice. Mice quite often like to eat cheese. These mice look quite cute, don't they? Fabulous. Let's try another. Copy me. Say the sounds, then blend the sounds to say the word. F, A, S. F, A, S. Your turn. F, A, S. Face. Show me your lovely smiley face, children. Beautiful. Let's try another. Let's sound talk our final word. Copy me again. Say the sounds, then blend them to say the word. I, S. I, S. Your turn. I, S. Ice. On a hot day, it's nice to have a cool drink with lots of ice. These ice cubes could certainly cool your drink down. We know the sound S is written like this. Today we are learning that s can also look like this. Hmm, this grapheme has another sound that we know. Can you remember it? Yes, this often says k. Now, let's read this new grapheme for s. Say the sound s each time I show you the grapheme s. Great reading of s, everyone. Now let's read some words with our new grapheme for the phoneme s. Read each sound as I point, then blend and read the word. F, A, S. Face. I love to see a smile on someone's face. Okay, next one. Read each sound, then blend. I, s, ice. It's slippery when there's ice on the pavement. How about this one? Read each sound, then blend. It's a longer word, so let's chunk it up. S, a, k, suck. S, a, s, sess. Success. My cake was a great success. Children, can you spot that there are two letter C's in this word? This first one says K and the second one says S. This often happens when you see two letter C's next to each other in a word. Read each sound, then blend. It, e, city. I like to go shopping in the city. 
Now, read each sound in this word, then blend. M I S mice. Mice like to eat cheese and other scraps of food. Here's our mice again. Read each sound, then blend. N I S nice. I like a nice hot cup of tea in the morning. Now I'm going to mix the words up. Can you read the words on the cards, but without sounding out? I definitely think you can. Are you ready? Off you go. Let's check. Read them with me. City. Mice. Nice. Face. Ice. Success. Incredible children. You have had great success. Now, let's learn to read a tricky word. We are going to learn to read the word your. Well, the first bit is easy, y, but the second bit is tricky. This says or. When I read it, I say y or your. Now read the word with me. Y or your. Excellent. Now you read it. What's the word? Say that again. Yes, the word is y or your. Now you know how to read this tricky word. Can you remember the tricky bit though? Yes, the tricky bit is that this says or. Can you read the word? Let's read it together. Th or t thought. Now let's read both words really quickly. I want you to read them aloud. Now let's read them together. Thought. Your. Did you get them right? Well done. Now let's read a sentence with graphemes we already know. Can you see any words with digraphs, two letters, one sound? Yes, these words have split vowel digraphs. I, I. This word has a digraph too. And another one here, U and O. Can you see a tricky word we read today? Yes, the tricky word is your. Now I want you to read aloud when I point to the words. Remember to sound out any words you're not sure of. Off you go. Fabulous reading. Now let's read the sentence together. Read with me as I point to the words. Six nice mice follow your cat for fun. Let's read the sentence one more time. Six nice mice follow your cat for fun. Wow, those are very brave mice, aren't they? Well done children, your reading has been quite brilliant. Now let's finish by spelling some words. Because if you can read a word, then you can have a go at spelling it. You'll need paper and something to write with. Let's spell two words with our new grapheme. Let's spell ice. Segment the sounds with me. Ice. I. S. Let's count how many sounds there are. I. S. 
That's two sounds. Watch me write ice. I need two sounds. The I sound is made with the letter I and then the E is at the end of the word. So it is written like this. Then the S sound is made with the letter C. But you need to write the letters in the right order, like this. Ice. I, S, ice. Now let's hide the word. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sounds. Write them down. Don't forget it's a split digraph. Brilliant. Let's check our spelling. You show me your spelling. Did you get it right? Ice. I -s ice. Well done. Let's spell another. Let's spell mice. Segment the sounds with me. Mice. M I S. Let's count how many sounds there are. M I S. That's three sounds. Watch me write mice. I need three sounds. M. I sound that I'm going to write next is made with the letter I and then the E at the end of the word. So it is written like this. Then the S sound is made with the letter C. But you need to write the letters in the right order, like this. the word. Now you have a go. Say the word. Say the sounds. Write them down. Don't forget the split digraph. Let's check our spelling. You show me your spelling. Get it right. Mice. M I S. Now let's spell a tricky word. We can read the word your, so now let's spell it. Segment the sounds with me. Your. Y or. Let's count how many sounds there are. Y or. That's two sounds. The beginning bit is easy. Y. The next bit is tricky because the letters O, U, R say OR. YOUR, Y, OR, YOUR. Right, let's hide the word. Now you have a go. Say the word, say the sounds. What's the tricky bit? The or sound is written with the letters O-U-R. Write it down. Are you ready? Shall we check our spelling? You show me your spelling. Did you get it right? Y or your. Well done children, you've worked so hard practicing reading and spelling and have achieved great success. See you soon for another lesson with letters and sounds. Mm -hmm.